welcome back to Infinity Platter. I'm standing today in Plaza de la Villa de Gracia to witness the spectacular event and tradition of Castellers. A castell is a human tower that's traditionally built during festivals in Catalonia and in few other parts of Spain. It's such a popular event where impressive human towers go up to six to ten stories high and almost seem to touch the sky. This is the first time I'm getting to witness such an event and tradition and I'm beyond thrilled. So let the celebration begin. The human towers represent solidarity and team spirit amongst Catalan people. On these depend the success of the tower and even the life of the young children that climb up more than 8 meters to complete the tower. The child chosen for this role is usually the smallest and the lightest and also the one that is celebrated the most after he or she greets the audience with a short wave from the top of the castell. The practice was first documented in 1801 as a cultural activity and then it became a competition in the 1980s. The castells have their origins in a traditional folklore dance in the city of Vals. The steps of the dance were accompanied with the flute and is still played today during their tower building. At the end of the dance, a small human tower was built. This probably has encouraged the ambitions of the dancers and the towers started becoming a phenomenon of their own. And the rival groups started building higher and higher towers. It is assumed that the castellers were officially separated from the traditional dance by the end of the 19th century. Typically, castellers wear white trousers, a black sash, a bandana, and a shirt in a bright color, often bearing the team's emblem. The sash is the most important part of their outfit. It represents the tradition as a whole. The sash is also believed to support the lower back and is used by other castellers in the team as a foothold or handhold when climbing up the tower. Castellers usually go barefoot as to minimize injuries upon each other as they climb to their positions and also for sensitivity when balancing and to have better feel and hold each other. This spectacular event was declared an intangible cultural heritage of humanity by UNESCO in 2010. Castells are now recognized as having a rich cultural diversity within Catalonia. So I watched three so far and they've been spectacular and this is the last one. And oh my god, do you see when the last child is on top, everybody's like shaking, oh my god, I'm so scared that somebody will fall, but they're so strong and experienced. So nice. I wanted to show you all. We finished watching the Castellas event and we came here because once they're fully done, they're all going to come back here and have a party with some music and drinks and giant pies. I'm not joking, I've been looking forever to find an event where they make these big pies and I found it. It is a gift the universe gave me because I came here um, not knowing that the event was somewhere else and then anyway, things happen um, as they should but it was a good mistake and that led us to this. This is for 100 people. Wow.
so mm, yum si it's perfecto it tasted of like the salt was perfect the has a nice flavor of meat i like it I'm gonna have to say bye for now. We are going to enjoy this giant paella, continue meeting new people, and continue our celebrations for the day. I hope you enjoyed this video because we love making it for you. I absolutely loved my first Castellers experience, and when you come here, if it's happening, you have to go visit and see this spectacular site. So have a lovely day, and I'll see you next week. Ciao.